Hi guys, this is Martin, aka Martin the Vlogger, and this channel is everything about writing, fun, and petrol hair words, plus one project that takes super long, but I'm about to reveal it and tell you more details about it, where you can get it, what are the conditions of getting it, yet yeah, there are conditions of getting it, and what it can do. It's a water-resistant casing for the pedal commander right over here, and yeah, in this video, I'll tell you the most important thing and I'll try to be super short. Now, enough of this, let's get started. Guys, before I will start, uh, maybe you have noticed that I have uh, introduced uh, some time ago a Patreon program from, for, the, for my YouTube channel, Martin the Vlogger. And all the Patreons uh, that are, you know, supporting my channel has seen this video before uh, everyone else. Uh, basically why it is important, because we will be just doing 50 of these casings in the first round. And the Patreons have been able to buy this casing way ahead of everybody else. So that's my, you know, additional bonus. And in case you would like to become a Patreon, have a look around, click the join button and have, this, ha uh, have a look what kind of options are available you're not only you know becoming patreon 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 but you are helping me to grow this channel to make a better content for you and grow this amazing community now hmm, what is this about and how to be really direct with you and i think the most important thing is to tell you true nothing but the true and the true so this thing what you will be buying in case you are interested in buying it it's a working prototype so you will be buying a working prototype in case you don't like this idea turn off the video don't worry i'm all fine with it i have decided that and however it will sound i promise to the community that i will deliver water resistant casing for the pedal commander and i will fulfill my promise okay however there are some limits however uh, i'm just a tiny manufacturer it is working and i will tell you what it will pro protect you against but i don't want to risk reputation of the martin the vlogger of mtv manufacturing and neither martin the vlogger shop the largest aftermarket shop for the Riker and spider parts and i will be selling everything from wheels that are several hundred euros to exhaust to parts from la monster to sway bars from byron and many other things and i don't want to risk my name because of this so i'm telling you up front what it will do i'm reviewing almost every profit that i will make on this uh, just to cover the cost and whoever is interested in feel free to buy it but you are buying a working prototype that we are still constantly or we will be developing based on your comments now you are thinking okay i will buy a working prototype what is the benefit for me benefit for you is that you will have a working case too in case based on your comments we will make an adjustment to it and it will be better than it is today you will be able to buy a new thing for the cost of production only now you see the price now what is this and there are basically two options you can buy a GoPro and you can buy 3M mount. Uh, I think there is one combo where you can buy both of them for extra cost in case you are not sure how you would like to mount it on your bike or car or whatever. The thing is, uh, the cost of production is something like 35 euros. It's not cheap and I will tell you why. So these are the conditions, as I said, in case you don't like it. It's, I'm all fine with that, no worries. Um, okay, so how it works and what it can do and how it is, and why it is so complicated to do it. Now, the pedal commander, you know that it's not only done for spider, but it's also done for cars or off-roading and rikers and slingshots and God knows what, what other, other things. So it was never really privately made to be out, you know? And I know that many people said to me like, Martin, why you just don't put it right over there where I put it and you will find just use the app on your mobile phone, right? I will be not using app on my mobile phone when I'm trying to operate my bike because I have app for GoPro cameras, I have app for drone, I have app for microphone, I have app for running app of the turning on all the apps with apps 
I'm tired of it. So my bike is everything about buttons. And I would like to have a control over this thing. And also, well, the initial idea was to have it, well, first I thought I would be able to make it waterproof, which then I realized that I'm not a Swiss manufacturer of watches. So then I said like, okay, we will make it water resistant, dust resistant and mud resistant, sun and wind resistant, okay? And on top of it, we'll be able to, you know, push these buttons in a comfortable way. So we are doing a 3D print. However, we are only able to make only three of these, actually with this thing, of course, three casings a day only. Uh, because we have other projects and we are just tiny manufacturer and if you think it's very easy just to push the print button and we have the whole case uh, done it's wrong as you can see these parts are it's it's a rubber around a kind of rubberish material that you know it's a double kind of sealant against water then you need to make this oh jeez when you Presenting something with one hand is quite complicated. So then you need to do this thing around cable. Uh, of course, super complicated thing is to put this plastic uh, foil on top, which was a little bit pain in the, yup, because uh, I wanted to have it in the way that I'm able to squeeze these buttons uh, as easy as possible. Like almost there is no foil, okay? So we have at the end, find the correct foil. Please, when you will get this, don't do this. Don't push it like this without pedal commander inside because you might actually destroy the water resisting function of it. I'm just saying. Uh, you will receive also uh, screws with it. So that's all fine. Now, why I'm so like careful of, of kind of telling you like you are buying working prototype. Uh, we have tested it and it works absolutely fine with many things. It just doesn't work when I have dump it into a jar full of water. So if this will be not working, it will be like $300 video. All right. Still fine. Oh, it even works like this. Cool. After some time, the water was getting in right over here, which is still fine because that's not the place from where the water will get into your thing. And yes, I'm aware, I told you, it's not waterproof, it's just water resistant and throwing the thing into the jar full of water is all fine. However, I thought it's gonna work a little bit better. It works absolutely fine. I've been riding one day with it and went outside, it was not raining, but I was spraying it on the parking lot. I went to um, uh, the high pressure water cleaning station. Of course, I was not water pressuring this, but the water was all around and it was all fine. However, as I told you already one time or two times, you are buying a working prototype. You will be helping to develop it in case you have great ideas how we can develop it. It's going to be only 50 of these available in the first round. And yeah, uh, and as I said, in case there will be adjusted version of it, in case people will like it and there will be adjusted version of it, you will be able to replace your unit for the cost of manufacturing plus shipping, which is going to be anywhere around 35 euros. So, and I'm promising my word, and you can only buy it at martindevlogger.com slash shop. I ain't gonna give it to anybody else to resell it just because, I don't know, it's just my thing. So guys, is there anything else I would like to share? Oh yeah, this thing, uh, you can buy two things. Uh, this is a GoPro mount. It's quite strong, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, or you can buy this a flat, 3M uh, twin tape kind of option, or you can buy combination for some extra money uh, of both in case you are not absolutely sure which one you would like to put on your bike. With the GoPro, well, be careful. Uh, 
it will not work on the other side with these three kind of pins. You need to buy something like this. So two holes or two pins only. I don't know if it's a male or female or whatever, but that's the first thing. And the second thing what you need to buy, it's, it's this uh, screw and this ending, okay? This metal part, it will go right over here and it's designed for these GoPro kind of mounts or endings. Uh, great thing is I'm using this from La Monster. Uh, it's one quarter of inch screw in there, so I, I will be able to probably, I will probably run it right over here like, like this, like you've seen on a previous video. Or maybe I'll just put it right over here, uh, as you can see. Now, with that thing that just fell, oh jeez. Now with this thing, uh, it's a 3M. It doesn't look good, it will be done a little bit better, it's just, I was doing it a little bit in a rush. Uh, it's a 3M VHB twin tape. It's probably one of the strongest that I ever has worked with. It's a great tape, however, when you are using it, and still it's winter kind of, it's end of February, um, when you will be applying it, and if you buy this option, have a room temperature, some, something like plus 10 Celsius. Don't, don't do it around zero or minus, because it will not work on your bike, that's, that's how it is. But they will be able to cope up with 100, 80 degrees I think or 150 something like that and uh, the logic is I don't care how it looks from the back side you will be still able to you know just simply cut it uh, however I would like to give you as much as a tape as possible Martin the vlogger is not a cheap ass so that's the thing now is that really it I guess so yeah one thing oh yeah one top tip uh, and what, or actually two things. Why I'm not adding this, it's cheap stuff. Uh, yes, I would like to add it to the box. It's not a problem. However, it's a COVID time and it's super hard to get anything into your mailbox. So hard to order it. So please guys, while you're waiting, you order GoPro mount, buy these things on your own. And maybe one comment. This is something that I have uh, and I will be testing uh, later uh, in the week. Um, it's actually a silicon glue I used for LED lights uh, that I will be just, that's another project that I'm working on. And that's something I would maybe recommend you to use. You can uh, try it. Uh, as I said, the casing is not designed for that uh, at the moment. It should work all fine with, uh, with only screws and tightening it up. By the way, don't use electric screwdriver use your hands only okay so you're not destroying anything uh, and uh, what you can do is basically you can put a little bit of this silicon glue right over here so you will basically protect it a little bit better or seal it a little bit better it's not needed that thing costs like 70 cents so it should be all fine guys in case you like it in case you would like to have it uh, go for it joseph golden you was helping me a lot. So one case goes for you for free. So there is only 49 left. One goes for me, 48 left. Several patrons has already told me that they would like to buy it. So guys, in case you want it, this is more of like my community tribute to you. Trust me or not, making several euros doesn't make really much sense. But in case, we like it in case something like this will help our community. I'm more than fine to make it. Guys, enough of this. In case you like this kind of video and you are not a subscriber, subscribe to my channel, have the notifications on. And remember, make sure you know that you are buying a working prototype and always have fun.